Hello, I'm, I'm Chris Kopp, I'm the Senior Museums Officer with Staffordshire Archives and Heritage and we're here in the ancient high house on Greengate Street in Stafford looking at our Retail Revisited exhibition which has just launched and goes on until January. Yes, yeah, so most of this exhibition is looking at living memory, so it's sort of 1950s onwards, the sort of shops people actually remember visiting, and it's a look at the changing face of Stafford's High Street over the past 50 or 60 years, and it's based around this wonderful frieze by a man called Herbert George Jackson, who drew every shop, every building in the High Street uh, in the 1960s on a long roll, long frieze, and he gave that to the William Salt Library in the 1960s. One of the places that older Stafford residents are sure to remember is Jenkinson's, who ran a cafe uh, and a, a, a confectioner's shop as well. Uh, we've got one or two items from, from Jenkinson's shop, including a teapot and one of the bags you might get one of your, your cakes from, from the shop. Uh, and I say, sure, most people who knew the centre of Stafford popped in there for a cuppa at one time or another. It's really important we have exhibitions like this. Uh, we live in changing times and we always have to a certain degree. So the purpose of museums and archives is to collect and record that change to help us understand where we live, how it's changed and how it will continue to change in the future. <laughs>